Hello, Unreal Engine is one of the most powerful and comprehensive 3D development platforms available today. With it, you could create an entire high quality game or film from start to finish without having to use too many different softwares. In this video, I'm gonna explore some of the key features of Unreal Engine, which you can use to create a variety of applications. We'll start with some topics you may not know of before moving on to more popular things that it can do like game development. First up, we have Motion Design. Unreal Engine 5.4 introduced the Motion Design Suite, created specifically for motion graphic artists who need a powerful, intuitive set of tools for rapid iteration and scalability. This suite includes a redesigned world outliner and user interface, specialized rigging tools, and cloners for easily duplicating assets, plus customizable 2D and 3D shapes. Motion Design also enables users' customization and easy versioning through adaptable logic rigging. With the tools in the suite, you can seamlessly create live on-air graphics with minimal setup, making it ideal for broadcasts, high-end 3D product design, and advertising visuals. Automotive. Unreal Engine provides everything you need to create breathtaking, real-time automotive experiences. Whether it's high-quality configurators or advanced in-car interfaces, you can easily import high-fidelity data from various sources and make real-time updates using Datasmith. If you don't know, Datasmith is a powerful tool integrated into Unreal Engine designed specifically for designers, architects, and artists to streamline the process of importing CAD, which is basically computer-aided design, and other 3D model files. This helps with keeping your products adaptable to any last-minute changes. For photorealistic rendering, Unreal Engine includes 164 automotive-themed physically-based materials and advanced lighting options like ray tracing for reflections, shadows, and lighting. Nanite technology also lets you bring entire vehicles at their original poly counts, ensuring every detail shines through without compromising performance. This was ages ago, but when I used to do Unreal Engine gigs on Fiverr, even though I'm primarily a game developer with Unreal Engine, someone hired me to basically make a simple car configurator for them. I'll show a video of it now. It's a bit basic, although it was a very good learning experience and also taught me how to use a different side of Unreal Engine. So for this, I had to use something called a variant manager to basically make it so you could easily um, make changes to the car. Architecture. With Unreal Engine, Architectural Visualization, or ArcVis for short, lets you turn raw CAD into immersive, real-time 3D experiences and beautifully rendered media faster than ever. You can import entire scenes, including animations and metadata using Datasmith. And if you don't have access to the original design files, Unreal Engine's built-in tools allow you to adjust models and UV mappings right in the engine. An example of Unreal Engine's potential in architecture is the Magnum Resort app by Interpres, which was designed to help sell luxury residences. The app allows users to explore a detailed 3D representation of the development site, providing a virtual experience that connects buyers to the projects before construction even begins. It's a powerful tool for attracting investment and showcasing future spaces. So with this um, architecture app, with Unreal Engine, there's also this thing called pixel streaming, which basically allows you to play and use Unreal Engine products on the web. So I think this app used um, ArcVis, which I've also used before. And it basically, in a nutshell, like I said, allows you to play and view Unreal Engine products easily in real time from your browser. Animation. Unreal Engine offers everything you need to create stunning animated content from realistic to highly stylized in a fraction of the time compared to traditional offline rendering. With Unreal Engine's real-time capabilities, you can make adjustments on the fly and instantly see the results, thanks to features like Lumen for dynamic lighting and real-time ray tracing for high-quality visuals without long waits. If you have Netflix and you've seen the series Love, Death and Robots, they actually used um, Unreal Engine for one of the um, episodes. So they used real-time animation on the episode called In Vaulted Halls, Entombed. So this was a gripping episode that featured a CG Kaluthu, metahumans, and other mocap-driven digital characters which were brought to life with the help of Unreal Engine. <laughs> And there's also this YouTube series that I checked out by Zandu, where he basically created um, this series which involves these alien characters. 
and he used the help of Unreal Engine to bring those characters to life. Animation itself, Unreal Engine Sequencer Multitrack Editor allows you to set up camera moves, character actions, and object animations seamlessly. You can rig and animate directly in the engine using the control rig. The control rig allows you to bypass the need to rig and animate characters in external tools, and instead you can animate them in Unreal Engine directly and save time between hopping between um, the 3D software that you use to basically animate and rig your character. You can use Unreal Engine just built-in tools instead. So with the control rig, you can create and rig custom controls on a character and animate them in sequencer and use a variety of other animation tools to aid you in your animating process. Or you can import motion capture data in real time with their live link system. Plus it has support for a wide support of industry standard formats like Ambient and FBX. Unreal Engine easily integrates with existing workflows making it a powerful addition in any animation pipeline. Broadcasts and live events. Unreal Engine brings powerful tools for broadcasts and live events, enabling photorealistic real-time rendering, real-time compositing, and breathtaking effects, all with support for LED stage setups and DMX lighting. Unreal's virtual production tools make on-set production efficient and immersive. With LED walls and volumes, you can place presenters and performers into any virtual environment stream live mocap data and control it all from an iPad or similar device. These tools have been successfully used by major networks like Fox Sports bringing NFL games to life with unprecedented realism and flexibility. I also know The Mandalorian also used Unreal Engine for virtual screen production when they're filming season one. Modeling. Did you know you can create 3D models in Unreal Engine? In Unreal, they have this modeling editor mode, which provides a tool set for creating, sculpting, and editing 3D geometry in Unreal Engine. These tools offer workflows for topology edits, UV creation, multiple material assignment, collision, editing, and texture baking. Games. Unreal Engine provides everything you need to create and launch successful games featuring industry-leading graphics, advanced procedural audio design, and a robust support for multiplayer and network experiences. With Unreal Engine, you have complete access to the source code, and you can choose which way you want to make your game. So Unreal Engine has the system called Visual Blueprints, which allows you to make a whole game without writing a single line of code, or you can use their powerful C++ to code your whole game, or you can use a combination of both C++ and Blueprints to make your game. So it's quite flexible, this makes it easier than ever to implement unique gameplay mechanics and optimize your game for performance. I'm even making a um, small indie game, it's a mascot horror game in Unreal Engine called Bobo's Fun Zone, and I found uh, it's been pretty good working with Unreal Engine, and that game should come out in late December or early January, because some people on my channel asked me about it. Okay, so we've explored some key features that you can do in Unreal Engine, such as motion design, animations, automotive, architecture, and a lot more. Although if you believe it, there are even more features. Like I think you can create VR and AR products in Unreal Engine, and it's constantly evolving. They keep on adding more and more new features. So whether you're just starting out in Unreal Engine or you're a professional, Unreal Engine's ever-expanding toolkit, I think makes it a very valuable resource for producing a diverse range of digital content. So that's about basically everything you can do with Unreal Engine. Let me know, am I missing anything? I think I covered all of the major topics. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.